Welcome to one minute, what the hell? So here we are playing Battle Chess for the NES. Uh, this is the game I actually had on the computer back in the day. Uh, this right here, the actual game itself, we just had the title screen a second ago. I decided to throw us into the game itself. So in this game, it's not your ordinary chess game. You have to actually uh, move your characters and they're actually animated. So they actually move and they walk. As you can see there. Uh, the graphics on the NES are a little limited. So, of course, the uh, DOS version looked a lot nicer. Yep, he's going to kick my ass right here. See what happens. And we have a little battle scene right here. Beating up my, uh, chest piece. He just killed me, and now he's conquered that little space on the board. I never really liked chess too much, but... When I first saw this game on computer, it's pretty much what... Drove me to actually learn how to play chess. See here, we have another battle scene, which, which is pretty cool. On the NES, I guess they have a separate battle battle uh, scene screen, but on the PC version, the battles actually take place right on the board itself. So there is a setting in here too, which I did not know about. The two D pieces. There's a level difficulty as well. So you can actually have the computer help assist you. So what they suggest is moving this character up here. So we'll do exactly what they say. And how you get that menu is just by hitting select. So there is some assistance in this game. I pre previously thought there was not, but apparently the NES version does have that ability. Now we have another battle scene right here, which is pretty cool. And the sound effects sound pretty good on the NES. It's pretty cool. Very simplistic sound effects, but they actually sound good. Uh, it is much easier to play on PC, though, for some reason. I'm just used to the PC version. Um, to say the least, this is the best chess game in my opinion. It's definitely awesome. Uh, Battle Chess is a classic, uh, no matter what system it's on. But if you have a NES or an old DOS PC, or if you want to use the DOS box, or whatever the case may be, definitely recommend playing this game. It's pretty cool. <laughs>